It's, it's a... <laughs> hey guys, Bella here and Trevor. This is my husband Trevor for y'all that don't know. And welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, what's up? Today we're doing a gender reveal for our child. So <laughs> we have our cake here. Let me see if I can show y'all. It's so cute. If I drop this whole cake, that would be like tragic. But we have our cake here. Oh, I thought you dropped it. <laughs> so yeah, we have 10 questions and we're gonna figure out if based on that question, I'm having a girl or based on that question, I'm having a boy. We're gonna keep score right here. And then you guys first, before I get into that, comment down below what you think I'm having, a girl or a boy. I have Instagram results and this is my Instagram results and this is what they think I'm having. So we're gonna see if this is correct. All right, so so let's get started. All right, so we're starting off with the Chinese gender predictor. So what is your what was your age at conception? 25. And what was the month of conception? April. Okay, so based on that, one point for the girl. One point for the girl. Crack a wow. <laughs> Okay, so what's next? Okay, so the next one is sweet versus salty cravings. So, uh, what type of cravings did you have? Uh, I had salty cravings and like spicy food cravings. One point for the boys. <laughs> one point for the boys. Okay, next. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the next one is morning sickness. Morning sickness. So tell us about your experience with morning sickness. I didn't really have morning sickness. None at all? I mean, I, I was sick the whole time, like my whole first trimester, but I didn't have morning sickness. Like I didn't throw up. I just was nauseous a lot. All right, so that's another point for the boys. All right, so what's that, two to one? Yeah. We two. got two to one. What's next? Two boys, one girl. What, so question number four? Yep, question, okay, number, question four. number four. Say, okay, so pregnancy glow or no? I don't know. Everybody keeps saying I have a glow, but I feel like my skin look regular. Well, I don't know what you think. I mean, I think with her tell y'all she not glow. It's not just my highlight. Do you, my, can my you baby, tell I have a highlight? My baby girl, ain't no hot. She ain't put no makeup on. <laughs> okay. No makeup. She flawless. She glowing, y'all. Nice. Inserts Beyonce here. Did so. <laughs> That's uh that's three points for the boys. For boys? So Yeah. Alright, so it's three to one right now for boy. Alright. Alright, so the next one is actually a question for me. What is it? It's Did you gain weight? Partner's weight gain. Really? So I've been working on my six pack. Um Okay, let's get to the truth. Yeah, I gained like like three pounds, bro. It's not even Alright, so yeah. So you gain weight? It's, we can be honest, I'm gaining weight, you can gain yeah, weight. Yeah, you have a child inside of you. <laughs> but, so it's yes, so what does that mean? That means, uh, it means we having a girl. A girl? All right, so the girls got two now, two finally. for the girls. And then the boys are at three, so it's three to two. Three to two. Okay, so what's next? All right, so the next one is the baby's heart rate. Okay, um, so the last time we got it checked, it was what? I mean, the last several times it's been above or below 140 it's been above 140 okay so the heart rate has been above <laughs> 140 so what does that mean yeah, that's that's three points for the girls so it's a tie three points for the girls three points for the boys what's next are we having twins we not having twins <laughs> mm -mm. Hey, no, one or both. that's not what's happening right. we what's that number six so we have four more all right and it's a tie all right so next is Sitting high or low? High or low? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. My stomach. It's like my stomach is like regular. I feel, but the baby itself is down here. So, so will we say low? Yeah, cause it's not up here. I mean, yeah, but I don't know what I mean by sitting. So it's like where my stomach's sitting, or I mean, if it's down here, it would definitely be considered low. Okay, so the baby's down all the way down here. So. Low, so this, we're sitting low. What's that? That is four points for the boys. Okay, so the boys are winning. All right. What do you think? So number eight, 
body hair. I've grown a lot of body hair. <laughs> I've grown a lot of body hair. It's like, uh, it's weird. Like, oh, my arms is like thicker than usual. Like my legs, like my stomach is like weird. So yeah, I've grown a lot of body hair. So. Yeah, that means uh, five points for the boys. So, so Okay, so boys. So what is it, five to three? It's five to three. I mean, I, I mean, if the girl wins the next one, mm -hmm. I mean, if the girl loses the next one, we're having a boy. Basically. But see, okay, so this girl we saw the other day, she said she's always done the gender, Chinese gender prediction, and whatever that said, she always went with it, and it was always right. So let's see if the Chinese gender prediction beats out, like, that don't matter. We this whole quiz. Boys are winning. I right mean, now. the boys are winning right yeah. now. But let's just see if, because the Chinese gender prediction said it's a girl. But if all the boys win, and I mean, the truth is in the cake. So <laughs> let's see. Go ahead. All right, number nine. Number nine. What side do you rest on? What side? Um, I rest on my. I would say here lately it's been your left side. But yeah. I'll, I'll let you tell it. I don't. I consciously sleep on my left side because I, uh, or lay down on my left side because they say it's better for digestion. So I guess my left side. Okay. Hey, the boys win. We're gonna. That's do, a boy. We're gonna do number ten. It's but, a boy. But I mean, the boys <laughs> won. It's the boy. So, I mean, six, six to to three. So no matter what this next one says, we're having a boy. According uh, to this, according but the, to this. the truth is in the cake. All right, so the last one is the Mayan prediction. Mm -hmm. So what was your age? So this is different from the Chinese one. Mm -hmm. um, it sort of uses the same stuff. But what was your age at conception? Uh, my age is 25, so that's the odd number. Okay, so odd. Mm -hmm. And what was your month of conception? It was April. So was since you're... Age is odd, mm -hmm. and the month is even. Mm -hmm. Seven points for the boys. It's a boy. <laughs> okay, so Seven the quiz says, the based on this quiz of these ten questions that we put together, it will be a boy. I mean, it's it's not even close. So based on that, it's gonna be a boy. Yep. All right, and, and it really comes down to the Chinese test versus the Mayan test, because the last one is a Mayan test. So the Chinese test says it's a girl. The Mayan test says it's a boy. But the same information. The moment of truth. You ready? Okay. <laughs> Are you gonna look? Just do it, just do it, just do it. <laughs> wait, wait. It's a girl! <laughs> I won. 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 I You know, man, you're gonna have a niece. Okay guys, thanks for watching. If you got the guess correct and you got 
the gender comment down below if you were correct and i think the girl had something going when she said the chinese thing was right so if you're pregnant do the chinese thing and then when you find out the gender let us know or even if you already had your baby do the chinese thing and tell us if it was right okay make sure you like comment and subscribe and that's all okay see you later bye